Thank you, Consul. Thank you, Mayor. Uh, thank you for, for listening to the residents of Brisbane. Um, you know, there should be regional respect for Brisbane as well. We have a general plan that was thought uh, in 1994. Uh, so planning history decisions are not made lightly around here. Uh, I see a real insensitivity to the will of our community. There's a constitution of the United States where there's a constitution of Brisbane as far as I'm concerned. Uh, the local leadership has really been terrific to the residents here, and I like to see it to continue to be that way. Uh, but there are outside influences. Uh, Mayor Ed Lee cutting the corporate tax in half has created this tech boom. Um, you know, there's several values uh, at play here, and I think uh, you guys have had the, the finger wagged at you uh, from, from many places, and a lot of them are out of town. I would like to remind um, you guys what um, the general plan is in 1994, Chapter 3, Community, community Character. I'd like to read that. The city of Brisbane and its mountain will remain a place of independent and distinct with a small town quality and a volunteer spirit where diversity is welcome and everybody can participate in town meetings and elected officials carefully consider the desires and the needs of the citizens and government through circumscribed rules and regulations only as required for the public health and safety and protection of the environment. I'd like to go on a little bit more. This is about Brisbane and its mountain. It stands more than a thousand feet high, this great outcropping of rock and scrub brush that surrounds the town like a pair of loving hands, isolating Brisbane from the busy metropolis grown up around, preserving here a time capsule of the way life was years ago, quiet, unhurried, comfortable in its familiarity with the land. Walter Blum wrote that. I want to carry on with another, uh, just two more paragraphs. Looks like I've got time. Um, Many factors contribute to the sense of security and well-being of the members of a community, including family, shelter, food, and safety. In Brisbane, this sense of security and well-being is also provided by San Bruno Mountain. There, a very personal feeling in Brisbane about the mountain, as former mayor Anya Miller said in 1975, you're protected in a way, this is what makes us a community. We all look out for each other and this bowl and there is a feel of neighborhood that you don't get in other towns. This chapter attempts to capture the importance of how the mountain looks and feels to Brisbane and how we can be good stewards for it. San Bruno Mountain rises above the San Francisco Bay and dominates the landscape of northern San Mateo County. Despite all the development in its valleys and on its slopes, it retains the character of what it may have looked like to the Custodian Indians and Spanish explorers. The bushlands, the grasslands still mix with the sharp roll oak and coastal sage growing in their native habitat. On the sheltered eastern side of the mountain, Owl and Buckeye Canyons face northerly and contain the largest woodland communities. The mountain is a habitat for many small animals, including meadow mice, ground squirrels, moles, raccoons, rabbits, opossums, and even foxes. The significance of San Bruno Mountain lies in its role as a natural protector from the elements, a habitat for protected and endangered species, a course for carrying storm waters and centerpiece of local identity and history, a resource for recreational activities, a definer of geographical identity within its bowl, and an enduring source of visual beauty. At this point, I'd like you to, in its current form, deny UPC's application until they can come back with something more reasonable. I'm against the potential of gridlock. Freaks out a lot of people around here. And um, the town character is at stake. Please keep it 